Now it's time to pay respects and give great attention to probably the most ignored organs of your body and that being the lungs. Although most doctors, hospitals and clinics don't inform us in the public of this, it is possible to clean your lungs considerably, inexpensively and quickly without being considered a fool, dummy and or a conspiracy theorist. As you know, many people have asthma, allergies, and other breathing and lung problems due to being in big cities, around industrial plants, airports, near car highways, because of excessive pollen, debris, and other contaminants. So here's some help on how to remedy the problem. However, controversial, or unknown to most of the public, doctors, hospitals, and clinics. My name is Otis Q. Pate. Top Cats Prime, bringing to you the unusual, but factual, and oftentimes ignored and controversial, wild news. Keeping you in the know, while you're on the go. And now, your wild news reporter, Q. Our lungs are a stencil for life and work tirelessly over and over, day and night. Breathing brings in oxygen and expels carbon dioxide, which is a waste product of metabolism. The lungs are made up of hundreds of thousands of branching tubes that end in tiny air sacs or alveoli, alveoli, spelled A-L-V-E-O-L-I. There are over 300 million of these sacs in our lungs, offering roughly the surface area of a tennis court to keep up with the respiratory demands of the body. Our lungs make up a large part of our immune system to help filter pollutants and infection causing microbes and capture them with mucus in the lungs and shuttled upward by tiny cilia, spelled C-I-L-I-A, for us to cough out or swallow. The lungs are simply remarkable and should be cared for. You should know if you smoke because smoking destroys the cilia that helps remove infection and pollutants, which results in clogged airways. Fresh, raw foods are the best way to get the enzymes, vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants that will help you breathe more easily. Okay, let's talk about lung cleaning herbs. Items like oregano, orange peel, l campane, eucalyptus, peppermint, lungwort, osha root, chaparral, and lobelia spell L-O-B-E-L-I-A, have been used for many hundreds of years, if not thousands of years, as natural remedies for respiratory conditions. So now, let's move on to some of these foods, like red bell pepper. These mild peppers are rich in vitamin C and carotenoids, lutein and zexanthian. These carotenoids have been shown to cut the risks of developing lung cancer. Pumpkin, that's another food that's rich in beta carotene and vitamin C, like carrots, oranges. Citrus is rich in vitamin C and vitamin B6 to help the lungs transfer oxygen. And carrots, by the way, these roots are rich in vitamin A, vitamin C, and lycopene which are all antioxidants that affect lung health and lower the chances of developing lung cancer. Beans, seeds, and nuts, all these items contain rich amounts of magnesium, 
a mineral that contributes to healthy lung function. They also provide extensal fatty acids, they're called, that are good for the cardiovascular system. And pistachios contain gamma tocopherol, a type of vitamin E that is believed by scientists to reduce risk of lung cancer also. And of course, organic pistachios and ones that are not salted. And if they are to be salted, they should be with sea salt or something like Himalayan salt, but not typical table-like salt that comes from the manufacturing plants. Now let's talk about grapefruits. Grapefruits contain naringian, and it's a flavonoid found in grapefruit that inhibits the activation of cancer causing enzyme. White grapefruit contains a large amount of this flavonoid and pink grapefruit has some too, along with the antioxidant lycopene. Grapefruit is especially good at cleansing the lungs after quitting smoking. And apples also contain a lot of flavonoids, vitamin E and vitamin C, and all help the lungs function at their best. Apples are rich in all of these things, and the more you eat them, the healthier your lungs become. So I guess that old saying, an apple a day, helps keep the doctor away is actually true. Turmeric. Now, this spice is related to ginger and offers many of the same benefits. It contains curcumin, a compound that encourages the self-destruction of cancer cells. Also on this list is pomegranate. Pomegranate juice slows the growth of lung tumors and they contain many antioxidants like elagic acid, which is also currently gaining strides in cancer research. Now, here is something called cruciferous vegetables like cabbage, cauliflower, broccoli, and kale have been shown to halt the progression of lung cancer and cut the risk of developing lung cancer in half. They are rich in chlorophyll and chlorophyll that cleans and builds blood. And it's also full of some very effective antioxidants. Now with chili peppers, peppers are filled with something called capsaicin or capsaicin, spelled C-A-P-S-A-I-C-I-N. This spicy compound is what gives chili peppers that fire, that heat. Capsaicin improves the blood flow too. And it also stimulates the mucous membranes and, along with all that, it fights infection. But certainly, we can't forget this particular root. This is ginger, because ginger is a spice, and outside of it being very potent to the taste, as you know, for those of you have, who have eaten raw ginger, it's also an anti-inflammatory property containing root which promotes the elimination of pollutants from the lungs. Now, garlic and onions, on the other hand, these pungent foods are great for the heart as well as the lungs, and they reduce inflammation, lower cholesterol, and fight infection. At the top of this list, which I would really put in tandem with at least 30 minutes of exercise, at least from my research into this information, Alkaline water plays a huge role in health and it is the base of any cleansing action for the body. Yeah, that's what's extensal. That's what's necessary to keep the blood flowing in the body and keep the toxins moving out of the body. It also keeps our lungs hydrated and the mucus flowing. It may sound disgusting, but the mucus is important and needs to be the right consistency 
to help trap and keep toxins, microbes, and other pollutants out of our system. By the way, other great honorable mentions as far as this cleansing process goes for our old, so precious lungs is chewing on or drinking peppermint tea, chewing on peppermint leaves. Chew on at least three to five peppermint leaves daily to fight infection causing bacteria in the lungs outside of tea other honorable mentions are let's see taking baths with eucalyptus in the water where you inhale it for at least 20 minutes hot the water should be hot that also will help flush out toxins that are in the lungs banana juice is also something i need to include in this batch because bananas are very high in potassium and potassium helps clean the lungs. You can also make smoothies with bananas as well as with cantaloupe, oranges, chico, spelled C-H-I-K-O-O, sweet potatoes, carrots, tomatoes, spinach, apricots, figs, etc. in order to, you know, get the particular taste that you like from whatever food it is that you prefer but at the same time being able to flush out and detoxify your lungs another thing is drinking green tea drink a cup of your favorite herbal green tea before you go to bed and i would say also in the morning to release toxins in the intestines that can lead to constipation because again, we're trying to detox not only the lungs, but things that work directly within the whole system. Another thing that helps with cleansing of the lungs, with the consistency of the mucus in the lungs, one of the things that helps tremendously is minimizing your dairy product intake. Things like cheese and milk and cottage cheese and things like that. That helps make your lung consistency as far as the balance of it being with the mucus, much better. And finally, one must stop smoking if that is really what they wanna do with cleaning the lungs, most especially if you have allergies or asthma will be a very big revelation for you because along with this regime of cleaning out your lungs, using the natural products that are from nature, quitting smoking will make a huge difference to you in no time. So these are the things that I recommend and this is what I wanted to share with you. I hope that you find the information useful, especially if you live in big cities, because actually you will not know how bad your lungs are until you start having problems which makes the situation even more complicated to resolve in the information description box will be links that will take you to the websites from where this information was compiled and confirmed through cross checking my name is otis q pate here for the top cats pride and the top cats rebel connection Thank you for joining me. This has been a Top Cats Pride Wild News Edutainment Report. Wow.